Alright everyone, this is it. I am finally going to do my ever first event on Genshin Impact. Three Realms Gateway Offering. So let's do this. Navigate. Okay, I need to go to Inazuma. Gotcha. So yeah, I have no idea what this event has in stores, but you know, it, it should be exciting. It should be interesting. So it does kind of suck that I did miss out on a few events, like there was the Asteroid one, um, like a uh, minigame festival, and um, I think something that has to do with Klee, and yeah, there, I'm, I'm sure there are plenty of other events I've, I've missed out on. So yeah, it, it, it does suck. Yeah, ho hopefully one day they can bring back events, you know, past events. Alright, so, so let's do this. Alright, so yeah, we're back. Hi, Coco Meat. This is the correspondence from Stingray 3. Your Excellency, the situation looks extremely serious. Hmm. Thank you, Ueno. Inform Swordfish 1 to stand by. I'll see to the wounded shortly. Yes, ma'am. Alright. Captain of Swordfish 2. Glad to have you back on Watatsumi Island. I would have liked to have given you a grand reception, but as you can see... What's going on? Yeah, what's up? Not long ago, I hosted the Watatsumi Goryo Matsuri. It's the most important ceremony on Watatsumi Island. I'm guessing you'll have heard about it from Tsuyuko? What? How did you know we were the ones helping out Tsuyuko this whole time? <clears throat> Tsuyuko is one of the more conscientious shrine maidens of Sangonomiya. I knew that handing off the planning of the ceremony to her would play to her strengths. <laughs> Based on her description of the person who took the commission, it was quite obviously you. This is all starting to sound pretty suspicious. Yeah, it's a bit light for that, Paimon. Anyway. I'm sure Tsuyuko will have told you that the Watatsumi Goryo ceremony is a ceremony to reverse the holy soil phenomenon on Watatsumi Island. Okay. It's a bleaching process that slowly turns the earth to holy soil, leaving the land infertile and devastating agricultural production. Granted, crops aren't our staple food on Watatsumi Island, but I can't allow external forces to drastically alter the people's diet. And we certainly shouldn't be overly reliant on imports. Uh, Paimon doesn't quite follow. <laughs> Imagine all you had to eat from now on was radishes. No more fish or meat. Clearer now? Yeah, that would kind of suck. Eating the same thing over and over and over again. Now that is the definition of, of insanity. Of madness. Doing the same shit over and over again. <gasps> that would be terrible! <laughs> I know! The issue began with the Watatsumi Goryo Matsuri. I did not miss a single step during the ritual, and there's no question that the blood branch coral you retrieved was infused with the Omikami's power. But it didn't reverse the holy soil phenomenon as expected. Instead it just... paused. This has never happened before in history. This is ultimately a matter of Watatsumi Island's survival, so I sent as many people as I could spare to Enkanomiya to investigate the situation. The news from Stingray 3 was that all of Inkanomiya is engulfed in a darkness that cannot be dispelled. Additionally, there have also been reports of monsters, the likes of which no one has ever seen before. Hmm. Strange monsters? And an all engulfing darkness? <laughs> That's all that Stingray 3 has reported. Their investigation otherwise has yielded no useful information. And the unforgiving environment has caused many casualties so far. I have sent several rescue teams already, but so far, the situation does not look promising. It brings me no pleasure to have to ask, but on behalf of all of Watatsumi Island, I beseech you, please, lend us your assistance one more time. Mm-hmm. Anything for you, my lady. <laughs> please, don't joke around. I wasn't joking, no. I was being dead serious. But thank you for once again agreeing to put your life on the line for the sake of our island. Now, please, come with me to meet Tsuyuko. Alright. Alright. 
Alright, cool. This should be interesting. Let's see here. Ah, yeah, that that girl, who's get, who gave us the the previous missions. Your Excellency, Traveler. Hello. I did wonder. Hope you're both having a wonderful date so far. Hmm. <clears throat> Cut the comedy, Tsuyuko, or I may have to have you and Naki switch posts next year. In which case. You'd be in charge of Spectre Eco Management on Watatsumi Island. <laughs> no need. No need, I'll stop. So, since the two of you are here together, I assume it's about Inkanomiya? Pretty much. Kokomi filled this in on what's been going on. Oh, Kokomi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's not right. amused. Well, as I'm sure Her Excellency has told you, an ominous darkness has completely engulfed in Kanomiya. At the same time, strange humanoid monsters have appeared when the place should be completely deserted. Humanoid... monsters? Mm -hmm. Armor that can move on its own. I know it sounds ridiculous, but we're not talking about one spook soldier hallucinating in the darkness. All the wounded who returned to Sangonomiya have described seeing the same thing. Hmm, interesting. On top of this, even ordinary enemies seem to grow much stronger in the darkness. That's why Stingray 3 has sustained so many casualties. There's one other thing that the returning soldiers have mentioned. They say a shrine maiden who calls herself Sumi has been helping to treat the wounded. Sumi? Hmm. I don't recall there being any record of a shrine maiden by that name in Sangonomiya. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. There isn't one. But she held something called a Sento ceremony, which managed to keep a small area in the very center of Enkanomiya brightly lit. Thanks to her, the wounded soldiers have a safe zone where they can recuperate. Sento. Hmm. I've seen this term in the Deep Sea Healing Arts Compendium. But it's a ceremony that only works in Enkanomiya, so it was never brought to Atatsumi Island. I'd love to meet this Tsumi. But right now, helping the wounded has to be my top priority. Your Excellency, even if you had no duties at all right now, there's still no way we'd let you go down there. Enkanomiya is exceedingly dangerous right now. Only preeminent warriors like the Traveler and Paimon should venture there. <laughs> yep, absolutely, a hundred percent. This is a job only we can handle. You really get Paimon? Yeah. <laughs> We've worked together plenty of times in the past, after all. Really? Hmm. Do you have any other information about Tsumi? It was mentioned that she wears a strange mask that covers the upper half of her face. Half of her face. How interesting. What is she trying to hide? Hmm. Maybe a scar or a wicked eye. I don't know. Your Excellency, in my humblest of opinions, Sumi has shown nothing but goodwill so far. Since the situation is so critical, we don't have the resources to make other defense arrangements and cast suspicion on our allies. Hmm. I see what you mean. I have instructed Swordfish One to proceed to Enkanomiya and continue evacuating the wounded. Traveler, you can go with them. Mm-hmm. Swordfish One will escort you to the camp at the center of Enkanomiya. Also, please, take this with you. What is it? Mm-hmm. Interesting. What's this? Looks like a missing piece of something. Yeah. It's just a little trinket. When you are faced with a difficult choice, it might be able to help you. All right, thanks. Your Excellency, uh, but it isn't that... Watatsumi Island doesn't need it anymore. Besides, both of the other two pieces are in Enkanomiya. If we're lucky enough, this could be our chance to reunite them. Hmm. Understood, Your Excellency. Okay. Emergency measures to hold the Three Realms Gateway offering now underway. Alright. Hmm. I 
apologize for the trouble. Now please excuse me. I need to tend to the wounded. Please, see Ueno once you're ready. Alright. Cool. Let's see here. Hey. Not that far. Here. Are you ready to venture into the dark shroud of Enconomia? Mm-hmm. Yep, let's go. All right, follow me. Here's hoping I have the chance. The chance to do what? Next year, I'm going to apply for Swordfish 1 to be redeployed into Spectre Management. Because if it's that, or spend more time in Enconomia, I'll take my chance with the Spectres. Those armor monsters closing in on you. It's the stuff nightmares are made of. Mm hmm. Anyway, we should be safe for now. There shouldn't be any more danger from here on out. Hey, what's up? <laughs> yeah, what's up? It's Yabe, the odd guy from Stingray 3. <laughs> you seem kind of chipper compared to all the other soldiers. <laughs> Do I? <laughs> <laughs> well, I've pretty much always loved horror stories and ghost stories and stuff, ever since I was a kid. This trip to Enconomia is something else, though. Totally mind-blowing. Alright, so you're kind of used to this kind of stuff. Super fun. 10 out of 10 would come again. <laughs> okay, that's pretty funny right there. Uh, totally do not understand. <laughs> well, I mean, it's pretty sweet to have the chance to come to Enconomia. I actually kind of wanted to look into the Bunkoku puzzle while I'm here. It's the first of the four great puzzles of Enconomia. Mm-hmm. Yeah, please don't do that. We're the ones that'll have to come rescue you. All right, well, never mind that. There's a makeshift camp at the top of those steps over there. Yeah, you should head up and catch some rest if you haven't been there yet. All right, thanks. All right, cool. Go to the makeshift camp. Uh, what's that symbol next to the Paimon button? Yeah, that. Mm hmm. Okay, gotcha. Alright. Hey, look! A shrine maiden taking care of the wounded! That must be Sumi, right? Probably. Let's go ask her about what's been going on. Yeah. So what's the stitch? different from all the others. Are you human? Oh, definitely. Well, at least from another world. Well, she is, obviously. Just not a native of Watatsumi Island, that's all. Yeah. And you? A human hatchling? <laughs> I doubt it. Oh, really? Because I thought that humans lose the ability to fly when they reach adulthood. Just like the Bethysmal Bishops lose the ability to see in color when they reach maturity. Uh-huh. Sumi, you seem to know a lot about bishops. Wait, how do you know my name? <laughs> oh, the wounded soldiers mentioned you. <laughs> oh. So yeah, uh, what's with the mask? It's kind of creepy, not gonna lie. Greetings, my name is Ueno, acting captain of Swordfish 1. 
We're here to evacuate the wounded and support the Traveler's investigation. Swordfish One needs to rest and reorganize before commencing the evacuation. I'll see you later. Eh. Yeah. Yeah, catch you later. So you're here to help resolve this, hmm? Mm-hmm, very much. Very well. It's taking all the energy I have to keep this light shining. I don't have the strength to try and combat the spreading darkness, too. Uh, do you understand what's going on? The Void Realm is invading. The people of Yakuyakoku believe that there are three realms. The Bishop Realm, the Human Realm, and the Void Realm. Mm-hmm, interesting. The darkness spreading in Enkonomiya comes from the Void Abyss. Neither bishops nor humans can endure it. But don't Bethismal bishops like the dark? No. They hate the light. But only because down here in the depths, the presence of light signifies human activity. In fact, the bishop realm is the realm of pure primordial elemental beings. It's actually referred to as the light realm in most books. Mm -hmm. The seven sovereigns of the light realm are the seven foremost elemental dragons at the pinnacle of the raw and primitive elemental forces. So that's why Suyuko called this the Three Realms Gateway Offering. Three Realms Gateway Offering. Not far off the mark, actually. But technically, I think it should be called the Triangle Gateway Offering. Mm-hmm. Triangle Gateway Offering. Because the source of the darkness from the void is the three towers at the corners of Enkonomiya's triangular borders. Mm hmm. Oh, the three towers! The ones where we did those trials! Yeah, in the last episode. You've been there before? Yeah, not that long. That's a long story. <laughs> well, technically it's kind of short because, well, we, we were really just doing that like, what, like 10 minutes ago? Something like that? Oh. Yeah, what's up? What's up with the mask? It's kind of creepy. To hide my face, it has to do with some things that happened as I was growing up. I just don't want to scare anyone. Okay. Does that make me untrustworthy in your eyes? No, not at all. You've been helping the wounded all this time. Everyone must be super grateful to you. It's just that. I don't... I don't want to be betrayed again. Me neither. I hate betrayal too. Anyway, if you want to rid this darkness from Inconomia, you can come to me for guidance. Of course, if you can trust me. I'm going inside to tend to the wounded and check in with the new arrivals. Please excuse me. Mm -hmm. We'll have to see if we can trust her. Oh, how about we go ask the wounded? Okay. Okay. Hi. Greetings. Greetings. Hello. We'd like to ask you about the masked shrine maiden, Sumi. Because of her strange mask? <laughs> well, you've come to the right person. <laughs> cool. Yeah, cool. I was one of the first people that she rescued. Straight away, I thought there was something very weird going on. Who is this shrine maiden who knows the lost ceremonies of Enkonomiya? And why is she covering her face with a mask? So I started pestering her about it. I wasn't going to let up until I got an answer. Mm -hmm. And? There weren't so many people around at the time, so eventually she let me look behind the mask. It was actually pretty normal for the most part. There's just one thing she's trying to hide. Her eyes have snake-like pupils, thin vertical lines. Oh, she's, she, so she's got snake eyes, interesting. Wow, weren't you scared? I probably would have been if every Watatsumi Islander wasn't so familiar with our legends, or, or I should say, our history. The first familiars of the Watatsumi Omikami were the vassals of Watatsumi. Legend has it that they are a half-human, half-snake kind, 
who helped our ancestors fight back the Bathysmal bishops. Mm hmm, interesting. They were said to have disappeared long ago. But then Sumi showed up, and as soon as I saw her snake eyes, I instinctively trusted her. It's like the vassals have returned to help us in our moment of need. Huh. Hmm. I'm no expert by any means, but I think Tsumi can be trusted. Okay, if you say so. But I kind of have my doubts. Alright. Hi. Hello, what can I help you with? Hi there! We wanted to ask you what you know about the mass shrine maiden, Tsumi. I see, I see. What are you looking to know exactly? I've tried asking if she's seeing anyone, you know, or whether she's looking right now, but she seems pretty tight-lipped about her love life. That's not what we meant <laughs> at all. Uh, we were more wondering, do you think there's anything suspicious about her? Yeah, is there anything sus about her? Suspicious, huh? Suspicion, the unknowable, the unpredictable, unexplored territory, mysterious, enigmatic, enchanting, bewitching, compelling, addicting, yeah. Know what I'm saying? <laughs> Be serious. I am being serious. Okay, look, if I had to pick one thing about her that's suspicious, I'd say, okay, two things. Number one, her mask. It's pretty scary. Yeah. I don't know why she chose it. Number two, some kind of pendant fell out of her sleeve when she was bandaging me up. It looked like it was a broken off piece of something. Hmm. So maybe when you put them together, it makes a hole. Okay, so she's got one of the pieces. Huh. Maybe the other half is held by Tsumi's lifelong sweetheart. Mmm, sounds like you hit the nail on the head. So, you know, maybe ease off a little, bro? <laughs> okay. Uh, what about you? Can you talk? It looks like they're resting. Um, let's not disturb them. Yeah. I don't think we've got enough answers now. Okay. Let's find somewhere to recap what we know so far. Alright. Zoomy's just inside the room. It'd be a bit awkward if she hears us talking about her behind her back. Yeah. Alright. So here's what we learned from the soldiers. Sumi's mask hides her snake eyes, which the people of Watatsumi Island believe to be a distinguishing feature of Orabaxi's vassals. Based on her actions, it seems like all she wants to do is protect the people of Watatsumi Island. And from what she said, she's doing everything she can to combat the darkness spreading in Enkanomiya. So she seems pretty trustworthy. Yeah, I still have some reservations. Paimon gets it. Like, why is she covering her pupils when they're obviously an easy way to win everyone over? Guess we'll just have to see what she has to say for now. But let's keep our guard up, just in case. Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's see here. So, hi. So, how's it going? Have you made a decision? Yep! Let's team up to tackle the darkness! Mm hmm Okay. Then take this. It's called the Bokuso Box. I found it in the Dainichi Mikoshi when I was looking for a solution. Mm-hmm. Actually... The Dainichi Mikoshi was where I found the method and tools for the Sento ceremony. Lucky I can read human writing. <laughs> uh, why wouldn't you be able to? <laughs> or did you mean it's lucky that you can read the ancient Enkanamian script? Oh, uh, nothing. I just meant the script in the Deep Sea Healing Arts Compendium. I don't actually know if it's ancient or modern. I'm getting more confused the more you try to explain. Never mind all that. Let's get back to business. The Bokuso box collects light. It can dispel the darkness from the void within a small radius. Okay. So, for example, with the power of the Bokuso box, 
You can turn monsters affected by the darkness back into their original forms. Hmm. As it happens, there are some monsters causing trouble around the camp. Go and try out the Bokuso box on them. I will join you shortly. All right. All right, let's take a look at this box. Let's see here. It's probably underneath gadgets, probably, yeah. Yeah, gadgets, okay. Equip. Okay. Okay. It's got 300, okay. Yeah, I'm not really sure what the 300% means. But whatever, let's see here. Also, I noticed that tree branch symbol on my minimap. I'll take a look at that after this. Hello! Alright, let's see here. Mm, okay. Let's see here. What's the hurry? To get frostbite. Cool it. <laughs> Dodge this. Rest and leave it. That's no one escapes by sight. Stop that. Freeze. So that was something. You're a good fighter. Mm-hmm. You bet! We were the ones who went and got the Blood Branch Coral that one time after all. Hmm. <gasps> what? You... So... you... Uh, what's wrong? Yeah, did we say something that we shouldn't have? <sighs> Nothing. <sighs> if what you say is true, then I'm sure you'll be able to conquer the three border towers quite easily. Okay. Also, there are a few things I need to explain to you. Okay, I'm all yours. According to what I have read, the fundamental purpose of the Watatsumi Goryo Matsuri is to use the Serpent God's life force to awaken its second familiars, the Senga Koralia. Mm -hmm. They are creatures that break down raw, primitive elemental energy into the milder elemental energy of the human realm, the giant coral is a symbol that the Sangha Coralia have been awakened by the serpent's blood. The mass awakening of the Sangha Coralia causes a transformation in the ecological environment of Enkonomiya. Makes sense. Even if you took away the darkness and the monsters, Enkonomiya would still look pretty different now with all the new plants and ore around. Things are even more complicated than usual this time. The darkness from the Void Realm seems to be suppressing things in the Light Realm and the Human Realm, causing them to come to a standstill. Mm -hmm. You may need to use the power of the Bokuso Box to dispel the darkness and allow the ecological transformation to continue. Please, try to solve the problem using the Bokuso Box. All right. I'll wait for an update for you under the statue over there. Okay, that statue. All right, man. It looks like I get I can use the box on 288 more times. I guess. Let's see here. Also on my map. Oh wow. Well, this area just got a lot more purple now. It. 
Okay. Let's see here. Okay, this looks like a challenge. Probably gotta use a box on this. Okay, yeah, use a box on challengers that have that purple shit around them. Alright, let's see. Alright, LB. Alright, LED. Alright, cool it. That surrender in LB Jim. Come a little closer. Blitz. Dodge this. Freeze. Oh, so sorry. You're in for a little shock. You've been a naughty boy. Hey! No escape! Yeah, let it ring. Where do you think going? I'm probably gonna need someone to play more if I wanna take care of this guy. I may wanna switch Amber because she's not exactly doing much, if I'm being equally honest. Keep Lisa. Next time, be okay. sure to make a proper appointment. <laughs> okay, I guess I'm gonna kill Yan Fei. Write this off as incidental gains. Light Realm Sigil. All right, cool. Huh. Get some more heals. All right, thank you. Let's see here. that you have mastered the Bokuso box. Now, let me tell you about the ultimate purpose of this operation. All right. As I said, we need to proceed to the three towers on Inkonomiya's borders. They're towers of the void, restored to their original form by a certain Abyss adherent. Mm hmm Abyss adherent? Wait, do you mean... He's a purveyor of incessant nonsense. Somehow, he found out about the Three Realms and the Three Corners, and brought those things in using Abyssal technology. Mm -hmm. Then, he started disseminating Abyssal energy using the Towers. This caused great suffering for both the Senga Coralia and the Bethysmal Bishops. I don't know why he's doing this. For us, the Abyss is highly toxic. For them, intoxicating is more the word. Addictive, but still destructive. Maybe he just likes to toy with people and stab them in the back. Paimon knows exactly who you're talking about. You know him? <laughs> then it seems we have a common enemy. Mm -hmm. Oh, you bet we do! 
To get rid of the darkness, you need to climb to the very top of the Towers of the Void and activate the Light Realm Chisel, which will let in the energy of the Light Realm. All right. In Enconomia, the ley lines of the Human Realm, the elemental currents of the Light Realm, and the dark currents of the Void Realm are all exceptionally strong. Also, I only performed the Sento ceremony going off the steps in the book, but I believe the key to the ceremony is the statue in front of us. You can offer crystals of Light Realm energy to it to increase the Bokuso box's power. Also, resting here can restore the box's energy. All right. Please, take this hand-drawn map. I've marked out the locations of the three towers for you. You'll need to explore one step at a time, and I'd recommend you start with this tower. Okay. Gotcha. Well, that's as much help as I can offer you. I'll be waiting here for the good news. Alright, thanks. Alright. I'm gonna use those sigils on that statue. Gotcha. Yeah, I think I think I got it. Alright, let's see. Alright, box. Okay. Zero out of fifteen. Okay. Okay, well, hold on. Yeah, that's luck. Okay. Event details. Mm hmm. Gotcha. Alright, let's see here. Okay, so cleanse one towers of the void, open 30 treasure chests in three realms, gateway offering, upgrade the box to level four, collect 10 ore, collect 10. Okay. Uh, quite, quite a lot of challenges. And some of them do give us gems. Let, that, that's like nine. So thirty times nine, that would be two hundred and seventy. No wait. Um. Okay, ninety. Ninety times three. That would be. Yeah, two. Yeah, uh, two hundred seventy. Yeah. Stuff. Okay. Details. Okay. Fifteen levels. All right. Let's see here. All right. I think I got gotcha. you. All right. Let's take a look at the statue. Core, gotcha. I want to look out for those chunks. Okay, gotcha. All right, so yeah, this should be interesting. 
probably gonna take a while. Though I do have 13 days. Alright, so let's go. Hold on, I'm gonna check my map real quick. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I think I wanna go from lowest to highest amount of this purple shit. Okay. So let's go. Yeah, a lot to do. Yeah, I'll probably keep my eyes peeled for any more um, uh, corrupted challenges. Yeah, so I can get more sigils. All right, work. Yep, work. We. Okay, I see a chest. Alright, let's see here. Yeah, very windy down here. Hello! So, bring on robots. That's my pick. Eat it. Huh. Motion to compare. Stop it. Dodge this. Freeze. Go boom. Ow, rude. Yeah, eat it. Huh. I must leave no stone unturned. Huh. Yeah, quite take heat. Don't get frostbite. Cool it. Steady as stone. Yeah, come on. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I got this handprint and a, a crystal on the mini-map. Yeah, so I probably want to investigate that. Let's see here. Ugh. Yeah, just give me a moment. Let's see here. Oh, hello. Alright. Oh, we're gone, mister. Okay. Box. Uh, 
trees. I must leave no stone unturned, as a dutiful maid would. Okay. okay. Definitely tanky. Box isn't exactly doing much on this guy. Whatever. Oh, so sorry. Dodge this. Maybe it's because I need to upgrade or something like that. Ow, rude. Oh, jeez. Yeah, he did a lot of damage right there. Hold the line. Yeah, I'm gonna need to freeze. Freeze. Steady as I don't think so. Yeah, sure you do. This will do. Cool it. Motion to compel. Yeah, I don't think so. Out. Rude. Right. Allow me. Dodge this. Freeze. Or not. Or yes, you will. Right. Thank you. All right. Play more. Our, our, our loot. Yeah. In a day's work. Cool. All right, let's see here. Mhm. Mm Interesting. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I think I want to collect that. Hold on. Yeah, I probably missed it. Okay, whatever. Yeah, there's always next time. Alright, let's see here. And what's this? Ah, okay. So I gotta look out for these rocks if I want to replace the, the, the box. Yeah, okay. Good to know. I'm sure that was explained in the tutorial, but you know, I just skimmed through the tutorials. And just kind of guess along the way, pretty much. I mean, that's usually my style. I just guess. Okay, here's another challenge. Alright, box. Alright. 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 Ow. Freeze. Hold the line. Don't get frostbite. Yeah, freeze. Covenant of the deep. Can you get your heels? I don't think so. Yeah, I'd probably bring back someone for the archer. No so I can hit the weak spot. Dodge this. Motion to compel. Cool it. I don't think so. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get this challenge. <laughs> yeah, only five damage. This <laughs> is. Oh, so sorry. Allow me. Stay right there. Billowing surge. Get it. You think I can get this done in the 50 seconds? Freeze! Ow, 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 oh Jesus Christ. Cool it. No, 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 no. Time for your arraignment! Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get this one. Dodge this! No. Covenant of the deep! Alright, I can at least get some heals. 
<sighs> okay, yeah. Alright, party sub change. Let's see here. Still a long road ahead. Hmm. I mean, my. Hmm. I guess the housework can wait. I guess we could do this setup. Sure. We'll see how it goes. Okay. Characters. Yeah, level up. Yeah, give me a moment. Uh, can I upgrade your talents? Let's see here. Yes, I can. Another Okay. Artifacts, let's see here. Could do? Okay. Alright, let's see about the setup. Alright. Let's try this again. Okay, box. Okay. Um, yeah, let me just take care of one. Wings of dark. 
darkness. Come, sever the... Check this out. Here's Becca. Damn, ow, 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 ow. Take care of everyone. Yeah, man down. Someone needs assistance. Ow. Time to clean up. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna get this one. Okay, yeah, I think I'm gonna cut my losses on this one. Okay. We gotta always try another one. Or, you know, I'll come back when I'm a lot stronger. So I'm gonna need two of those blue crystals. Okay, gotcha. These crystals. Yep. Ooh, wonderful. Ah, right, let's see here. Okay, gotcha. Okay, now can I unlock the waypoint? Throwing all the curveballs, huh? Alright. Hold on a bit. Yeah, hold on a minute. I'm gonna take a bit of a recording break. BRB. Alright, I have returned. Alright, let's see here. And we're still gonna look around, grab some stuff. Like some of these crystals. Okay. There you go. Hello, Hilly Trolls! Yeah, bring no it. Stone unturned. Yeah, kills. Nah, I don't think so, Mister. And let me burn that shield. Fire it up. Yeah. As a dutiful maid would. No. Stop that, you little shit. Bellowing no. thunder. Yeah, zappy, zappy. Yeah, yeah. Don't get too close. Oh, reveal thyself. Yeah, eat it. Yeah, it's up there. Hey. Midnight Phantasmagoria. Supported fire. Yeah, burn, baby, burn. Leave it all to me. Take this. Check this out. Is it life? Oh, he's in a bush. Get out of here. 
in here. Alright, let's see here. Okay, good lunch. Thank you. Uh, that is the objective. Well, hold on. I just want to grab this real quick. Alright. Yeah, I do want to look around. I see a Sealy. Crystal. Right, thank you. Okay. All right. Yeah. Let's get this silly real quick. What's up? Okay, grab more of these flowers. Slip was right. Hmm. <laughs> okay, hold on. I have an idea. I mean, yeah, I guess I do have a duplicate. Yeah, unlock. Yeah, let's actually do that. Let's refine it. Because why not? Yeah, I just need I just need one slime and condensate in order to ascend this weapon. Okay. Actually, you know what? Um Yeah, since I'm not really using strongly, I guess I can switch it out for this. Yeah. Yeah, I only have the one. Okay. Alright. As for your artifacts, let's see here. Hmm. I can don't really have a whole lot. Okay. Well, whatever. Anyway, uh... Okay. Alright, thank you. Alright, so what's the challenge? Let's see here. Alright, start. Hi! Don't get too close! Here's Becca! As a good night should. Steady as stone. Hey, eat it. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, use the box. Thunderclap! By royal decree! Definitely a dangerous area to fight in. From which it's saying at the end of the world. Don't get too close! 
Shadow Raven, let night fall! Come on. <laughs> At least all alive. Like, what the heck is going on? Well, come on. Well, this was, um, this was an interesting, interesting fight, I guess. Yes. How am I getting out of this mess? Yes. Crap. Hmm. Okay, yeah, hold on. Yeah, t teleport. Yeah, may, may have to restart the challenge because, well... Yeah, challenge felt. <laughs> yeah, not not exactly the most ideal area to fight two bosses, two enemies. Okay. Well, well, whatever. Turns out we next time. Thank you. Thank you. All right, let's see here. Under my events. Ah. Alright, thank you. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Right, more crystals. Alright, thank you. Oh. Flemish. All the rewards. All right. Uh, I guess we'll take care of this one chest over here real quick. Hi. Right. Take this by royal decree. Yeah. yeah. Come on, bleeding. Oz, reveal thyself. Steady as stone. That's not a crap. Time to clean up. Wings of darkness, come, sever night. Someone needs assistance. Yeah, I guess I am bleeding. They still need me. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, I need to heal. So yeah, apparently there there is a mechanic where you you are slowly bleeding. Yeah. Okay. 
スターだLook out for platforms, huh? Thank you. Wow, that must be the tower Tsumi was talking about. Hmm, doesn't look very climbable. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Okay. 
Hello, Electricity. Oh boy. Okay, yeah, those are definitely new. I guess, I, I guess those are the moving armor guys that they were talking about. But hi. Yeah, hold on, I'm gonna look at air tutorial. Okay, let's see here. Defender. Line breaker. Promotion Jesus shield. Gotcha. Hold the line. I must leave no stone unturned. Yeah, definitely tanky. Like holy crap. Freeze. This moment will be frozen in time. Give me a second. Nope. Yeah, it's really tanky. Like, am I even doing damage? As a dutiful made one. Yeah, I'm doing damage is very piss poor. <laughs> Now, this is gonna take forever. Okay, yeah, screw this. I think I'm just gonna keep moving. Yeah, I'll, I'll definitely have to come back here once I'm done with the story bit of this of this event, and then I'll pretty much gonna do some grinding after this. You know, because, because this isn't exactly cutting it. My my character is way too weak. Eh. Okay. Ah, it's these guys again. Yeah, I'm not exactly in a position to fight you guys, if I'm being completely honest. Oof. Let's get some heals. Controller. Okay. Hey! This pattern seems to match the one on the tower. Could it be relevant? Hmm. How about a puzzle? Anyway, let's see here. Yeah, hold on, it says that there's a few items for me to collect over here. Flower. Okay. Okay, hold on a minute. Okay, yeah, the box is losing energy over time. Probably because there's a lot of dark energy around here, pretty much. Flower. Right there. Okay, let's get some heals. Oh, bird egg. Okay, that was kind of random. Okay, what's under my vents? Probably another reward. Interesting. And I 
think it has something to do with these. Ah, shit. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're ready to roll! Um, but how do we get the towers to link up? Okay. Let's look for clues nearby! Uh, can I unlock this one? Yes, I can. Okay. Okay, so I need... Ten of those. Dusk gem. Dusk gem. Gotcha. Okay, let's see here. just need to find 10 of those dust gems so we can unlock this and then we'll turn to the final final symbol. But the question is, where do I find dust gem? Gems, plural. That's a million dollar question right there. Maybe those armor guys drop that kind of that kind of resource. Hmm. I gotta end him badly. Okay. Yeah, I guess I can fight some of these guys. Leave it all to me. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm doing so little damage. It's not even funny. In fact, it's kind of embarrassing. I guess I'm just going to have to be patient about this one for much- Ah, and they're doing a lot of damage. I'm doing very little damage to them, and they're doing a lot of damage to me. Like, what the heck? Freeze. Yeah, I'm gonna need to freeze. Motion to compel. I must leave no stone unturned. Leave it all to me. Like, what am, I, what am I doing wrong here? Like, these guys are practically bosses. Starting to get a lower dick list. 
This is gonna take forever. Okay, hold. Yeah, I'm I'm out, I'm out of here. Like, holy crap! My characters, they're so poopy. Damn it! <sighs> okay. Okay. Hmm. This is an this is an issue right here. I guess we'll head back for now. It's like, yay, yay, yay. Okay. Catch the wind. Alright, let's see here. I'm gonna do a bit of a Google search of where I can find this Dusk Gem. So it looks like I'm gonna need to kill the shadowy husk enemies and those... And, and of course the chests that they're protecting. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Okay. Like the problem is that they're so tanky. Be stumped. Like I, I might, I might, I might be kind of screwed. Okay. Hmm. Just what will we come across this? that real quick. Well, that's not exactly going to work on her with the whole animal, animal damage because she's Electra at the moment. Hmm. Try one more time. We're just gonna have to be patient, be vigilant. Just yeah, just 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 keep at it, pretty much. on this guy over here. Yeah. 
Motion to compel. Leave it all to me. Allow me. From boom. Covenant of the deep. Yeah. Okay, okay. I got one guy. Okay. Hold the line. Steady as stone. Okay, okay, okay. Incinerate. As a good knight should. Uh, that time it did work. I mean, yeah, they were tanky, but it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't as bad as you know last time. I think it's because I did upgrade the box or the statue. So yeah, I, I, yeah, I, I did make some offerings. So maybe that help. I'll keep this close. Yeah, if it, yeah. Let's let's actually look at the events real quick. Okay, let's see here. Okay. Well, whatever. Okay. Inventory. Let's see here. Where is our new item? Underneath. There it is. Okay, we got we got twelve of them. Okay, so we we can unlock it. Okay. Oof. Okay. All right, let's go. Give me a second. fight you guys. At least I don't think so. Oof, okay. Replenish. Alright, let's try this again. We just need that symbol. Right. I can't see. 
I can take off. At least we're gonna say more now. All set. Now we can climb on up. Mm-hmm. All right, let's see here. Very ominous. The whole purple shit. Alright, let's see here. Use the box. The first one is done! Alright. But the abyssal energy that was released when the towers connected doesn't seem to be disappearing. The darkness is infiltrating the land and causing changes in the surrounding area. We should go check it out if we have time. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we did part one. Yeah. Okay. Alright, um... Yeah, I, I, I think I'll divide this into parts. Like, if I was... Like, if I was gonna do the entire story event... Yeah, the entire sto the entire story of this event, then yeah, it will be kind of long. So I think I'll divide this into the the parts of well, yeah, the the actual parts of this event. Anything else before we we head back? I just, just want to see if I collected everything in this area. You know, like 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 the important stuff, like the flowers and the crystals. Okay, yeah, I, I think we're good here. All right, let's head back. Yeah, let, let's head back specifically to Mondstadt. Okay, now I'm gonna check on the guild real quick. Oh, it's you! Over here! Over here! It's Sarah from the Good Hunter! Yeah, maybe another time. Yeah, do I have any... No, just one. Okay. Whatever. Alright, back to the guilt. Add Astra Abbot. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we got some new areas over here. Uh, okay. Nothing too crazy. Okay, whatever. Yeah. Go beans. Right. Battle pass. Event. Climb our ward. Three gems, nice. And yeah, we're almost done with this this page, the first page. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna check on the blacksmith. Yeah, because I do have a a part. Thank you. All right, let's see here. Uh. Yeah, let's make this one. Uh, no bonuses? Okay. Yeah, I'll make some of these, since I got plenty of chunks. Yeah. Thank you! Cool. Alright, let's see here. Inventory. Let's go ahead and refine that. Okay, so... Okay. 
And let's go ahead and refine Ben's weapon. And where are you, my man? Yeah, all the way to the back. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we're fine. I want to do before I end the episode, end this part. Uh, I guess ingredients. Uh oh, that pass. Right, level. Thank you. Ingredients. Yeah, sure, let's do some cooking real quick. I think I'm gonna end it right here. So yeah, uh, I think next time I, I will do some grinding because yeah, that was a uh, that was not looking too great last time, you know, not too long ago. So yeah, um, so next time I'll do some grinding, you know, level up, get some better artifacts, and then we'll continue the event. I mean, I still have plenty of time. So yeah, and plus we did we did do the first first part out of three or how many parts it takes for the for for the story bit of that event. But yeah, everyone, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Later.